In this video, I break down 25 of the best free jailbreak tweaks on Cydia. But first, a quick note from our sponsor. Earlier today, I watched a brief movie called In Search of the Most Dangerous Town on the Internet about hacking and cybercrime. One of the things that struck me is how big hacking is in Romania. I had no idea. It's so pervasive that one small town is nicknamed Hackerville. In fact, over a billion dollars was stolen last year by hackers in that area. Eye-opening to say the least. This movie was created by Norton Security, who makes trustworthy software for internet security. Click the link here or find the link in the description to watch this movie. I think you'll be just as surprised as I was to see how big hacking is today. The first release on our list is none other than Activator. It is a staple jailbreak tweak that allows you to do things like this. I'm triple pressing on the home button and I can use that to play and pause music among many other things. There's tons of stuff you can do with this tweak. On Palm is a tweak that presents an action menu after taking a screenshot. So you can take action on that screenshot. You can save it to your photo library, copy it to the clipboard, upload it, share it. This is a really awesome tweak. If you want to copy an image really quickly, you can do so. CC controls is another must have because it allows you to customize the toggles in Control Center. Courier is a quick reply and quick compose jailbreak tweak that allows you to quickly send messages, quickly reply to messages, view the entire context of a message. I really can't believe this is a free tweak. Cydia Impactor is a new tweak. It is relatively new, that is, and it is a must have for anyone that's jailbroken. It allows you basically to completely restore your device to stock yet stay on the same firmware. This means you can do a clean restore and still retain your ability to jailbreak. Cylinder is a tweak that brings custom transitions between home screen page swipes and it's absolutely free unlike Barrel, which it is inspired by. Fuse allows you to have your clock and music controls all on the same lock screen. Icon Renamer allows you to, well, rename your icons just by tapping them in wiggle mode. I'm going to rename the App Store icon to App, I don't know, App House. I don't know why I chose that. I'm just weird like that. But there you go, App House. Cody is a jailbreak app that allows you to run, well, Cody on your jailbroken iPhone and it's absolutely free. If you know about Cody, you know how awesome it is. It allows you to stream TV directly to your phone, etc. all sorts of things. If you have a Touch ID device, you'll appreciate what Lockglyph does. It does this. Lyric for Music allows you to access song lyrics directly from Apple Music just by tapping on album artwork. So even for songs that are streaming, you can pull in music lyrics just by tapping the album artwork. Next is Multi-Delete. It allows you to delete multiple apps at the same time just by tapping on each app you want to delete while in wiggle mode and then tapping the X just like that and then tapping Delete. Awesome tweak. No Bar Plus allows you to browse Cydia in full screen mode. So that basically it removes the status bar while you're browsing Cydia that allows you to see more content on screen at once. No slow animations. You probably have peeped how my animations are really fast when I open up apps and folders. That is courtesy of, of course, No Slow Animations, a free tweak that speeds up animations on a jailbroken iOS device. Pheromone is another tweak for Cydia that allows you, to, well, you see the tint there, you get the brown tint, that's new, that's courtesy of Pheromone, and you also get a little share button here so you can share tweak information with others. Reach App is a tweak that brings true multitasking to iOS. It is a free tweak because it's currently in beta. I don't know if it'll ever get out of beta, but it's a really cool tweak. It allows you to use multiple apps, well, two apps at least, side by side, true multitasking, awesome tweak. You know how in iOS you can scroll to the top of a page by tapping on the status bar like this? Well, what if you could scroll to the bottom of a page by tapping on the status bar like this? Awesome, huh? Spectral is a tweak that gives you a nice album artwork based background that's blurred out. You see the album artwork from, from the currently playing song in the background looks great. Status Vol X removes the volume HUD and replaces it with volume indicators in the status bar. Swipe for more speeds up your Cydia experience by allowing you to swipe on Cydia packages. You can queue them up for install or deletion. And this is all done just by swiping. It really does enhance and speed up the Cydia experience. Swipe selection is that staple tweak we all know and love that allows you to swipe on your keyboard to move your cursor. You can even use it to highlight text just like that. So good Apple stole it. Type status places a now typing indicator in your status bar, just like that. 
Very handy tweak to know when someone's typing. And untethered Hey Siri allows you to use Hey Siri while you're not plugged in. Lastly, you have Wink, which allows you to tap on your status bar to reveal it, and Zeppelin lets you replace your carrier name with custom logos.